that that's not me. Over the years, I've made a ton of movies at Pizza Hut locations. I, I don't know why, but that was a video we started when my local Pizza Hut in Howell, New Jersey closed down. Oh yeah, I actually took the sign from that Pizza Hut. Now, it's no secret, Pizza Hut has seen better days. I've visited a ton of locations over the last couple of years. Even those weird ones that are inside Target that never seem to have any food. Even ones that have this weird purple phone that nobody seems to know what it does. Have you been to a Pizza Hut lately and, and looked around and wondered, what the hell happened? In the 80s and 90s, Pizza Hut was king. At Pizza Hut, we go all out to make it fast, hot, and delicious. Look at how happy these motherfuckers are. As a kid, I remember winter nights when darkness fell really early and the restaurant was dimly lit. The pizza would arrive on this, it would arrive sizzling in this cast iron pan and placed on this weird cork tray. The breadsticks were perfect, handmade, or so it seemed, even if they weren't. My pizza had, had it all. Buffet, jukebox, and atmosphere. On a recent road trip, I stumbled upon a classic Pizza Hut. I had heard about these, but never thought they actually existed. But they do. Oh, baby. They do. I mean, it looked like an old Pizza Hut. It smelled like an old Pizza Hut. It felt like an old Pizza Hut. The staff was great. They even had the salad station. There was book it reminders, a classic sign, the red cups. And the pizza came out on that weird f***ing cork thing. I don't know what I expected going here, but somehow my expectations were exceeded. I hope more Pizza Huts return to this style because the world just needs it. <laughs>